Hi guys, and welcome to this week's Frozen Friday. Today I'm going to be venturing out into the cold to hopefully find some cool frozen stuff at the store. I plan to stop at a few places, so hopefully they have some interesting stuff, maybe even some Easter related things as well. So I'm pretty excited to see what we find. Here's the frozen section. Got a lot of these are new dolls I've never seen before. The skater dolls. There's the normal Mattel ones I'm recording. Just letting you know. So I don't I'm like looking like an idiot. <laughs> Got stuff on the end <laughs> Oh, and there's the first people though. How much are they here? I'm just wondering. Fifteen. What, this one? Yeah, I've seen that one before. She sings and stuff. Interesting. Oh, look at these. Look at those. Those are goofy looking. Big, big cape, the shoulder capes and stuff. Yeah. They have a lot more stuff than last time. Here. Look at the alarm clock. It's a coin alarm clock. You put coins in it. And it plays Let It Go. That's cool. It's light music. It's activated when a coin is inserted and then the button is pressed on the back. Yeah, that's cute. It's got the same design on it as my other one. Got a bunch of plushies there. Yeah, that's a really pretty set right there. I have one that's similar to that, but their dresses aren't sparkly or nothing. This is really cute. Oh, there's the Cinderella. Wow, I didn't know those were out already. Look how expensive she is. She's really pretty though. Frozen patio set. So cute. And little plastic chairs. There's some of the puzzles. There's that one. There's one that I have. Ton of Easter stuff at Walmart. Got tattoos in it. Magnetic pieces. Marker design bag. It's Easter activity thing. Scrubbing plates. Journal. Scratching designs. Cosmetic set. Frozen shaped eggs are all gone. It's color and style. Kind of cool. It's like an Easter bag. Get some little things over here. Some little barrettes. Some more barrettes. It's like a brush. Little activity things. 
and some design stickers. And a few different things for frozen tree stuff. Some more frozen Easter stuff. This is like some kind of special gift set. It's got stickers, a ball, chalk, and bubbles inside of it. Pretty cool. It's an Easter Olaf. It's a little basket of eggs. Well, I made it back from my shopping spree, more or less, but uh, here was a few items that I picked up. My camera didn't last me as long as I was hoping, so I didn't get to record some of these items where I got it, and I'm also not allowed to record in Hot Topic, so when I went to Hot Topic, I couldn't record in there. But these were the items that I got. Um, here is the Hot Topic exclusive on a bow, hair bow. It is really, really nice. I saw pictures of this online and I had it in my wish list. So I was actually really shocked they finally got these because these were out or have been out for quite a while. It is really nicely detailed. It's a nice representation of her outfit that she wears all throughout the movie, pretty much. There's even the little balls or fuzzy hanging balls or whatever on the top of the bow here. And then the front has her uh, rose modeling that's on the top of her dress. And the bottom is like her skirt pattern. So it's really, really pretty. And it has a basic clasp. To wear it and I'm so excited to wear this. I really hope I can get the Elsa one. They don't have it yet but it's possible they might get it later on or soon. I'll be going back to Hot Topic this weekend so hopefully they'll have some more stuff. Some other items that I got at Hot Topic were these little uh, string dolls. They're kind of goofy but I thought they were pretty unique because these are all individually handmade and it's just the constant wrapping and tying of a string to make these characters. So this is the Elsa one and this is the Anna one and they do come with little tags so you can actually give them to friends if you want to and these are by Lounge Fly that makes all the other awesome stuff that Hot Topic carries. Here's the Olaf one. And I was looking through these and of course since these are handmade each one is slightly different from the next. These were the two, uh, three that I chose. Elsa's got a huge head which I thought was funny. But yeah these are really really cute and these run about $6.50 each. I thought they were pretty unique for what they were. I've seen other ones like this like for other Disney characters and such so when I saw these I was like oh cool the, they did the frozen characters so these are the only ones I know that they have I I didn't actually see these on the website so they're kind of unique I think and last few things that I got were at Walmart these are the color and create plushes they come with three markers each. These are the ones that come with the Olaf one. And Olaf actually gets some stickers so you can stick to him. Here's the back of the box. He's completely washable plushes so you can draw on them with the markers and wash them and redo it again and again. So they're by Inkus, I think is the name. And I saw some reviews of them online before I got them, and I have a friend who actually got these too. And I guess there's a large and a small version. I think I have the large versions, but I'm not 100% sure. So I guess you can correct me if you want to. But these are really cute, and then it comes with a little 
hook to hang your markers to the plush after uh, you're done playing with it. Now, I took them out so you can see them a little better. And they do have flat bottoms, so they'll sit perfectly for you, as you can see. It's hard on the bottom, so you can uh, stand them. And Olaf has all these little pretty uh, snowflakes all over him. And I really like the way he's like sitting. I think it's cute. The back has a lot of summery type images you can color. So yeah, it's a really cute plush. And then I also have the Elsa one. It's really, really cute. I really love the design of these. They remind me of the Japanese uh, crane machine plushes, which I have a lot of for the Sailor Moon. So when I saw these, I thought they were just adorable. <clears throat> but she comes with little jewels instead of like regular stickers that stick on and three different color markers on the back it shows you a little bit of one that's colored in but I'll take her out so you can look at it but here she is I think she's just adorable I really 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 like these I love the stitching, the embroidery on them, and the facial expressions, and I love their choice of thread on the lining as well. It's really, really cute. Um, on the back, you have Olaf and a bunch more snowflakes to color. So that's really, really nice. I like that. And then I have Anna, which as far as I know, these are the only three characters that were made like this but here is Anna and this is what her box looks like she comes with three different color markers and different gems than the Elsa one does and the back of the box looks like this give you an idea of how you can color her if you wish but I'll take her out too so you can see her and as you can see, the outlining of the thread is very shimmery. They did use a nice choice of thread with these. They, they do have a lot of eye-catching qualities, I think. On the back, you have the same image as the Elsa one, but it's pink and uh, maroon colored. But yeah, these are really nice. And I got these at Walmart. Um, they usually run, I think, $20 each. I think I paid... 15 yeah I paid 15 for these so they were a little cheaper at Walmart and they had these at Target and Toys R Us too so you have a different uh, few different choices to purchase them but I hope you liked this week's video I definitely hope to do more of these type of videos in the future if you guys like them so definitely give me a thumbs up and let me know what you think of this video Alright, well thank you so much for watching. Definitely like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you all next week. Alright, bye!